Hi guys, hi gals. I wanted to talk with you about a list of all religions and belief systems part 10 and this this time I'm doing in different parts the whole thing and the not and nothing but the thing and the whole swimming thing so yeah so there's like there's like yeah this is part 10 like I was saying and it's all in the clue and the names in the title pay more attention to that than, than anything else um, so there's there's five more after there's four more after this one it's, no sorry five more so um I'm so this so this description of this one so I'm getting cracking right now and this one is is called pantherism pantherism is spelled p a n t h e i s m pantherism it's in in brief without reading the whole description it's about it's about god being everywhere and the, and that is not trend that is and that is not trans, trans transcendent and 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 no distinct consciousness so what it so it's just saying that it, it's is I understand, I understand that as as a god being dead or not being fully alive it's about it seems to me how, how I understand it is as is like a god that that is that is that is not fully that that does not have does not have does not have full human characteristics and is not because it says in the description about trans transcendent it says so transcendence mean beyond or above or above the range of normal or mo or merely physical human experience so that's what it's saying it doesn't it doesn't seem like th this god that they that that it, this God in this religion, which is called pantheism, is not, doesn't go above. God doesn't go above human experience, which, which seems to be. Seem it seems to be that you know it's not really a God. If because if, if we if we if we study what a God, a God really is, it it. It means that it's more, it's more higher, more more powerful. And with the other parts, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm going to be talking about because there's one, there's one description of a religion that talks about the high, about hierarchy, and this this god that's been described shows that it it seems to me how I understand it, it seems like it seems where how I understand it sounds like it has no, it has no no hierarchy no proper hierarchy like like it's like because the meaning of hierarchy is is a is a system or organization in which people or groups are ranked one above the other according to status or authority so it's a bit it's a bit like what i said before but um yeah hierarchy spelled h i h i e r a sorry i spelled again h i e r a r c h y yeah so but let, let me it seems like it's talking about a, a dead god panther in, in pantherism that's how I understand it as, but you know, 
I won't draw any conclusions with that, but I'm just going by what I see and what I'm studying right now. I move on to Pastafari Pastafarianism, which is spelled P A S T A F A R I A N I S M. It's a long word. It's about a, a it's about a, a, a religion about it's a it's a religion on on a, on, a, on the spaghetti monster. It seems like it could be a film. By the way, how it's been, how, by the way how it's dis, been been described. So yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if they bring out a film in it anyway. But I'm, but I'm not sure about that. It seems like the the, the name Sp Spaghetti Monster sounds familiar when I say I, I'm not sure about it, about it being a film, but it's the the, the name does sound familiar. It's Flying Spaghetti Monster, as if as if it was a mo movie title. So yeah, I will move on. Oh, just got this thing with. That has that pops up. So this this one it's People's Temple, which is spelled P P O P E O P L comma S. Temple is spelled T E M P L E. It's a pop ap apocalyptic suicide cult. And it resulting in six hundred adults, six hundred adult deaths, and two hundred and seventy six children's death. So, like I said about the devil, he comes to steal, kill, and destroy our lives, and not just that, he has come to impart his spirit, demonic spirit, in our bodies, the devil, to control human beings, to control the human race, and to, and to upset God, because. Cause like I heard, like I just just like I heard today, in my in in my in my new church, they said, they said. For for the devil to upset, for 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 God to be upset, he troubles his childrens, or any or any human beings. By by, by by, by, jumping in or or impart imparting their their, their imparting their spirit. Their demonic spirit in in human beings. So yeah, six hundred. So this one, second, this and this, and I'm, I'll move on now. The second to last one, polytheism, which is spelled, which is spelled P O, sorry, P O L Y, T H E I S M. Polytheism is yeah, it's, it's a multiple of, of gods. It's a multiple of gods in some kind of in some kind of hierarchy. I'll give you the I'll give you the the, the meaning again and the spelling of hierarchy. It's spelled hier hierarchy spelled. H I E R A sorry H I E R A R C H Y and the meaning I I'll, I'll tell you again a system or organization in which people or groups are ranked one above the one one above the other according to status or authority synonymous meaning pecking order comma order comma ranking so yeah that's 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 um so with this one if i got the right one the multiple so this one polyeth polyethism it's it's just, it seems to me like it's similar similar to to 
to Hindu religion because in, in in the Hindu religion there's many gods in that religion and many gods and many seasons many seasons many many callings and many everything but I I what I don't get about with all these many gods is that it can, it can be confusing to keep track of all these gods because you know for example if you're not if you're a big organization and you're trying to manage all these different gods with different gifts and talent it'll be difficult to keep track of them unless you write it down but you can say it's all spiritual but we are we are with we, we then have to find evidence of what it, what is that being being spirit or being spiritual where where is the evidence and the confirmation in our own bodies and minds because if god is real if there is a god and, and he is real surely he is able to communicate and talk with us verbally and in 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 his own in, in and in his own kind in in his own kind and in his own spirit so yeah that's the question i i i i bring forth bring forth for to anyone that's wondering about all, all these many gods so yeah let me move on to the very last one for this for this part part 10 so it's raja yoga which is spelled R A J A and Yoga Y O G A and it, and it's an Astika by Hindu by Hindu It's about around, around Hinduism about about quitting the mind and it and involving meditation so if you look up the word a s a s t i k a which i'll find right here it should it's just it's literally it's literally just a name and it's to do with with hinduism as far as i can see it because raja is is i is a, is as i as i understand it is a is a Hindu Hindu name. So I think it's already here. Actually, I don't want to use. Uh, yeah, it's just a name, but you can look up the name. It's. I don't know if you were here. You were working with me. Yeah, I'm not gonna look I'm not gonna look in, look into it too much but because I don't wanna it, it I don't wanna like go too far with it because at, at the end of the day really like I said before it's just a name and it's spelled A S T I K A Astika or Astika, yeah, Astika. Hopefully, I've hopefully I've pronounced it correctly. And yeah, that's yeah, that's really all for this part. So um, before I finish, let me just pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for your grace and mercy you put upon us from past, present, and future. Pray, grace that will go before us, that you're able to meet with meet with us, Father, at the point of need, that you're able to help us and restore us to our original form, from past, present, and future. Protect us and help us help us to forgive one another, as we as we forgive those, and please forgive us for our sins, Father, and and all of our sins, in Jesus' name, by and by power, by grace, Father, give us strength. For the next day, help us not to feel tired in Jesus' name, Father, as we go about our daily day day to day task, and pray you pray your mercies and favor will shine upon us and rest through on us and be with us and remain with us, O oh God. We as we and we plead the blood of Jesus on these situations on these situations and us, O oh God. And once again, O oh God, please forgive us for our sins. 
we pray these things all in jesus name we pray amen god bless you guys and gals bye for now peace be with you